Hi, I welcome you all to yet another episode of Folklore and Culture. So here we are going to talk about certain cultivating tribe. So we have been talking about nomadism and migration. We also have talked about tribes, those they were indulging themselves into um, hunting, gathering. So kind of assimilation which has happened. We will go more through it. But before that, we will be uh, talking a little bit about cultivating tribe. So we know that basis of all human activities, uh, their culture or probably even their religion, it depends on economy. And this economic uh, process of realizing um, or you know choosing a particular subsistence pattern um, has given birth to different kind of ways of subsistence. So may it be nomadism, may it be migration, may it be semi-nomadism or cultivation. So we are going to talk about a very important tribe which have developed themselves um, as a cultivating tribe. Also, there are certain myths and certain, uh, you know, uh, problematic areas uh, which they are facing due to economical problems. For example, the Bheel tribe. So there are different types of Bheel tribes. Another group of Bheel, which is Bheel Tadvi, they are generally a mixed form. They have adopted Hinduism as well as Islam. Some of them work as agricultural laborers, some of them rear sheep, some of them collect forest goods and sell them in the marketplace. So mostly they are into agricultural jobs and animal husbandry. Then there are other groups of bheels as well like bheel barela who are distributed in the district of Khandwa, Kharegao, Hoshangabad, Narshimpur of Barel. Bheels in Tripura are referred to as bheel or pachima. So we end this discussion today here but we will be back soon with yet another episode and I would like to thank each and everyone who is watching these videos and giving me suggestions and um, I am trying to incorporate all the kinds of suggestions which are coming to me and it, it is kind of overwhelming when um, I get suggestions and people talk about these videos and um, I am really really grateful and thankful to each and everyone watching me. Thank you.